Hi, welcome back to the channel. It's county fair time. Uh, I'm actually reshooting this intro because uh, I don't know what happened to my original one. But uh, I felt like I needed to uh, do a little background for uh, the video today. Um, so you guys have seen uh, the, the two little white goats that we had the naming contest for, uh, Petunia and Daisy. And those were the, the kids' 4-H projects this year. And um, I wanted to kind of show you what they were doing at the county fair. Uh, they're in the, uh, the Clover Kids division, so there was no real judging. It was really more about just getting the kids used to what they're supposed to be doing. And um, I don't know how much you're really going to get out of this one, just because uh, it, I, I didn't film the kids at all. I didn't want to get them on YouTube, and I kind of wanted to try to protect, you know, there's a lot of people there. I kind of wanted to protect their privacy, too. So um, I really just kind of filmed the goats as we were working and as we were going through the show and we did the weigh-ins and stuff like that. But, so I, I don't know what you're gonna get out of it. Maybe there's not a whole lot, but at least uh, it shows a little bit about what the kids were doing. And uh, very proud of them for the work they put in with the animals over the last, oh, couple of months. And uh, I think those girls are gonna be really good additions to the herd. Uh, assuming they can breed for us, I think they're very friendly, very tame. With a bit of luck, they could be very good milkers for me. So I'm really looking forward to that. I don't think we're gonna get them bred this year because they're just too small. Uh, so it'll probably be next year, 2023, and maybe probably early 2024 before they actually have their babies. So we, we just gotta bide our time with them. But I think they will be uh, very good for, good for what we're doing here and great additions to the herd. So here's what I got filmed and I'll, uh, I'll catch up with you after it. check-in day here at the fair a lot of activity going on a lot of people here a lot of stuff going on Ch people checking in their animals weighing them all the 4-h uh, clubs are here a lot of stuff going on so uh, join us while we get our uh, goats weighed in and get them set up where they need to be and I don't know I don't really know what I'm doing this is my first uh, too, first county Katie. fair So interesting to note that this little guy eating his grass was born at our place here uh, back in January. The people we sold him to turned him into a show goat. So he looks pretty good. I'm glad to see him doing well. They named him Buster. So that's cool. I guess he busts down doors and stuff. I didn't think he was that aggressive when we had him, but that's okay. We sold him to these people probably in April, maybe, uh, March or April, and he was pretty little then. He's definitely put some weight on since then. So that's cool. That's cool seeing him in the show, so that's awesome. Here's the arena where we'll be showing the goats tomorrow, so that's cool.
did a good job with these. Stuff. Competition's about to start. I think Daisy and Petunia are about as good as they're going to get. Stay tuned. How you doing, Petunia? Here's Daisy. You girls a little tuckered out? Are ya? Good girls, you guys did very good today. Very proud of you girls. So, that's the end of the show for today. We, uh, the competition, I'm gonna get out of the sun here a little bit. The competition we did today is not really a competition, it's more of a program for the younger kids to get involved with 4-H uh, and whatnot. So they didn't have any uh, awards or anything like that, but uh, it got them used to the process and how to, how to do things, how, how the show is, is conducted and all that. So it was good. Worked out real well. They learned something. I definitely learned something because I've never done this before. So uh, it's been good. It was uh, a lot of fun. We're going to go to uh, go home, take a little break, get out of the heat for a while and uh, come back a little later to feed them and uh, do the evening chores, but uh, that's it for today. So, thanks for watching.